Hi guys, welcome back. Now in this video, we'll be looking at CARICOM. Okay, now we're still underneath the topic of challenges and opportunities of regional integration. Okay, so first we must ask, what is CARICOM? Now, CARICOM stands for the Caribbean Community and Common Market, right? And is defined as an organization made up of 15 Caribbean nations to promote economic integration among members. Okay? Now, CARICOM became the Caribbean Community, which is CARICOM, right? And that was in 1973. Okay? So what we'll be looking at next is um, we're going to be looking at members of CARICOM. Okay? Members of CARICOM. First off, Jamaica, Barbados, and the Bahamas. Second, Antigua and Barbuda, Trinidad and Tobago. Third, Belize, Guyana, Montserrat, King St. Kitts and Nevis. Fourth, St. Vincent and the Grenadines and St. Lucia. Fifth, Grenada, Haiti, and Dominica. So we're going to look at the associate members, right? Who are these? No. British Virgin Islands and Cape, um, Turks and Caicos Island, right? And no, they joined in 1991. Next up, we'll have the Cayman Island, right? And they joined in 2000, right? Okay. So what we'll be looking at next is OECS. What is that? Now, OECS stands for Organization of Eastern Caribbean States. What does this mean? Okay. Now, the OECS was established in 1981 by the signing of the Treaty of Bastère. Okay. Now, first and foremost, original members of this organization are Antigua and Barbuda, Dominica, Grenada, Montserrat, St. Kitts and Nevis, St. Lucia, and St. Vincent and the Grenadines. Now, the British Virgin Islands joined as an associate member in 1984, and so did Anguilla, but in 1995. Okay, I'm sorry they're not listed, guys, but just um, listen, okay? All right. So moving on, next we are going to be looking at ACS. What does this mean? Okay, this means um, Association of Caribbean States. What is this? Now, this is a convention. Um, the convention establishing the account was signed on July 29, 1994. And this is in Cartagena de Indias in Colombia, right? Okay, now, first and foremost, members of the association are Antigua and the Barbu and Barbuda, sorry, the Bahamas, Barbados, Belize, Colombia, Costa Rica, Cuba, Dominica, Dominican Republic, El Salvador, Grenada, Guatemala, Guyana, Haiti, Honduras, Jamaica, Mexico, Nicaragua, Panama, St. Kitts and Nevis, St. Lucia, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, uh, Suriname, Trinidad and Tobago, and Venezuela. Now, associate members are Aruba, France, uh, the Netherlands, Antilles, and the Turks and Caicos. Right? Now, Next, what we'll be looking at uh, are the functions of ACS and, they are, and what they are based on, right? Now, before we go into that, um, the functions are strengthening regional cooperation and the integration process, okay? I think all of these are um, self-explanatory, so we don't need to get into details. Second up, creating an enhanced economic space in the region. 
Third up, preserving the environmental integrity of the Caribbean Sea. Fourth up, promoting the sustainable development of the greater Caribbean. Okay, now the association has a ministerial council, right? Which is the principal organ for decision making and overseeing, right? The direction, the direction of um, the association. Now, and they also have a secretariat which deals with administration, right? Now, next we'll be looking at, uh, there are five special committees consider, right? And these are trade, development, and external economic relations. Second up, sustainable tourism. Third, transport. Fourth, natural disasters. And fifth, budget and administration. Now, the council meets at a summit each year in a different location with the region. Now, the ministerial council will make um, declarations that address issues affecting the region, such as human and drug trafficking or the treatment of small economics in the um, context of a large free trade area. Okay, so next up, we'll be looking at CSME. What does this stand for? This means Cari CARICOM Single Market and Economy, right? Now, what is this? This is, this is an integrated development strategy envisioned at the 10th meeting, meeting of the Conference of Heads of Government of the Caribbean Community, which is CARICOM. Now, which this took place in um, July 1990 in Grand Anse, um, Grenada, right? Now, heads of government express a determination to work towards establishing like a single market and economy in the Grand Anse de um, Declaration and work program for, for the advancement um, of the integration movement, uh, which, is in, which was in um, 1989. Okay, now the CARICOM Treaty was revised in 2002, and although the CSME has been like established and has 12 full members and a number of associated members as well. Full implementation has still not been achieved. Okay. Okay, guys, that's it for my video. Uh, thanks for watching. I want to say thanks very much to my subscribers. I've seen a lot of persons subscribing. And oh, guys, for um, all the uh, all, all, the persons who are doing exam i wish you all the best on your exams and also um urging you to share my videos so, so other persons can subscribe as well for those who are doing the exam next year uh thank you very much for subscribing as i said before and guys um whosoever um uh, they, they have been viewing but they're not subscribing i'm urging you to subscribe so you can know when i release a new video okay guys thanks for watching bye